Okay. I wanted to quickly show you how to remove extra space from the bottom of the pages if you change things or delete things. So I have updated this, so now this is a repeater. Um, so again, uh, just to remind you of how to edit these, click off of them once and then click on it once to get to this Manage Items um, button. And then this will allow you to move these in different order if you want. Um, and then you can also add new ones by duplicating them. So, um, and then you can duplicate the ones with the color if you want to alternate the colors, green to, to um, beige. So just delete or duplicate the one you want and then reorder them in the way you want. Um, and then of course double click on things to edit. But let's get down here to this uh, space. So now there's all this extra space here because we removed this. So there's a few ways to get rid of space. I like to use this little drag handle. So when you click on things, a lot of times this will come up. Um, now it looks like we also have, I'm not sure what this is. Oh, this is a strip that's kind of hidden here. I'm going to get rid of that. So that's probably why this has been problematic because there's this little weird hidden strip there. Um, so I've deleted that and then we're going to come down here. Now we got to adjust the page size. Um, so this is the little page height tool that I use. So just kind of, oops, and see, you'll see, I make mistakes too. So don't feel bad if you do stuff, use your undo. But that's what I just did. I used it on my key command. Um, but then I can just drag this up, give it a second so it reloads, then scroll up. So basically I'm just kind of scrolling up so I can get rid of all that extra space. So now that is go now gone and um, that shouldn't be a problem. So now when you add these, this should actually automatically scale if I add another one. Let's just try it real quick. So when I add another one, you'll see it pu pushes everything else down. So you don't have to worry about the space now. I don't think the space will probably be an issue, but if it is, I just wanted to show you how to fix that. Let's go over to your Where to Buy Natives page because this one also had that same issue. We'll scroll down and here we go. So here's this extra space. Um, part of this is also because right here we have a couple elements we need to get rid of. This native plant services, since that's no longer on this page, we're going to get rid of that. I'm also going to delete this line, which we don't really need. Um, and then I can grab this strip and pull this up. So this is in a strip. That might have been what that other strip was. Things don't have to necessarily be in strips. They're just a way of organizing and structuring, keeping things together. Um, so on this page, these are in a strip and that's fine. But you can use the same drag tool here. And that gets rid of all that extra space here. So um, I'm going to publish and that's the, it for this video tutorial. But um, let me know, of course, if you have any other questions or, or issues when you start editing this. Thanks, Sherry.